So I just want to do a quick video on this um, ozone sensor I got off of AliExpress. It um, says it measures between 0 and 100 parts per million ozone. You use the data sheet and all the communication information, how to connect it in here. So let's see, we have ground. VCC for the power supply of 5 volts, TX and RX for the serial input output. And uh, we have the device hooked up to a USB serial converter right here. And that's wired, so you got your power on the left, TX and RX on the right. As you can see, we're supplying 5 volts from the USB put together a Python script right here and you can see we're connecting to the serial device and then reading all the serial data in hexadecimal and then converting it to a parts per billion ozone concentration. So we'll get that running here. And right now it's reading the room ozone level at around 37 parts per billion, which is, I guess, pretty average. So I wanted to test this device, see if we can get it to measure a little bit more ozone, make sure it's working. So I got this kombucha bottle here and uh, one of those electric lighters. This is a nice arc here. So we're going to go ahead and get that arcing inside the bottle. See if we can fill it up, get some ozone going. That should be enough to measure. It kind of smells like something funny in the bottle now. And I just shorted it because I have a shoddy wiring system. Seems like it didn't break anything, but go ahead and right now we're at 37 parts per billion. We'll stick that right in there and immediately starts measuring more. Pretty quickly got some ozone going in there. 55 parts per billion just about. Seems to be stabilizing. So I thought I'd do a quick video on getting that little sensor up and running. The $20 ozone sensor from AliExpress. The Mixen sensor.